Hello and welcome to a new episode from Zyxel Support Campus. Today I want to introduce the GS1915 24EP. It's a power over Ethernet switch that is ideal for installing together with our small access points. Let's see what's inside the box. The switch comes in an eco-friendly box that consists mainly out of cardboard. It contains the user manual, FCC card and warranty declaration, a power cable, the rubber feet and the mounting kit for 19 inch racks and the device itself. Unfortunately all these parts have to be packed in a plastic bag because it can scratch during the transportation. Also you can find a bag with screws for the mounting kit. The GS1915 24EP has 24 ports up to 1000 megabit, where 12 ports are with power over Ethernet in total for 130 watts. At the bottom of the device you find the details, on the back side you find the power connection and the grounding, on the side the fan hole and the screw holes for the rack mount kit. The installation of this model is very easy in four steps using the Nebula app or the Nebula control center. Let's see how this works. The GS1915 series is simple, affordable and cloud-based. It is slim, noiseless and various models are available. We have two 8-port models, one with 60W PoE power and two 24-port models, one with 130W PoE power. Onboarding to the cloud is very easy. You need either the web configuration tool or the Nebula mobile app. You can use it as prosumers, small business, customers or in chain stores. The simple four steps to onboard the device I will explain you now. It is easy to register the switches using the Nebula app which you can download from the Apple Play Store or the Google Store. You create your account or you sign in with an existing account. There are various security ways to verify your account. You can also choose the two-way factor authentication to secure your login. When the account is created, you simply sign in using this account and we are ready to book your first device to your Nebula Cloud. First you open a site name and the location where the device is located. You can activate your one month free trial version or you do it later. Then you scan the QR code from the box or the bottom of the device and register this device to the Nebula Cloud. Next step is to connect the power and the ethernet cable to the device and bring it online so it can be seen in the dashboard. Now the device is online you have various options to see the network and switch status, the power usage of the devices and other tools to monitor your network. It's easy to maintain and monitor your network wherever you are and have internet access. Enjoy the Nebula ecosystem, which you can build from switches, firewalls and small access points. Go and visit our website under zyxel.com and check the opportunities for Nebula and the products that are Nebula aware. If you have a question about the product, please leave it in the comment section or visit us on support.cycle.eu. You can find more than 600 help desk articles in different languages and the contact to our support team. We are done with our episode. Thank you very much for watching. If you like the video, leave a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel so that you do not miss any of our new episodes. Also, you can follow us on Facebook. 
For all our partners, we introduce the page partner.cycle.eu with special offers and services for our resellers. Thank you very much and have a nice day. We're Zysel and we're your networking ally. You like Zyxel videos so much, then just open up another one. It is called Binge Viewing. And subscribe to the channel so that you do not miss any of our new episodes.